Hello, ladies and gentlemen. We're here at Nexus 2012 with our host, Jamie Ian Swiss. Jamie, thanks for joining us. Uh, pleasure to be here. Now, this is being run by New York City Skeptics, which you are a co-founder of. Right. Um, this is Nexus is a production creation of New York City Skeptics jointly with the uh, New England Skeptic Society, and uh, I'm a co-founder of the New York City Skeptics. I started the national. I, I co-founded, co-started the National Capital Area Skeptics around 1987, and 20 years later helped start the New York City Skeptics. So we've got you to blame for this show. Exactly. Exactly. It's all my fault. Now, the fun part about this, this is, I think, the fourth Nexus. This is the fourth, and the first one we've expanded to a full two days. So, and you've been the host and MC of all except for one of except them, Except right? for one. Last year, I, had, I unfortunately had a conflict, and I asked my friend uh, and colleague, uh, Todd Robbins, to step in for me. But and that was, I'm glad to be back. Oh, that was a great time, too. But how do you compare this one from the first one? It's hard uh, to say exactly. I've actually heard some comments from people uh, about that. I think we've got... Uh, we've achieved this year this sort of nice mix that we're looking for of of content and of uh, some of some of performance that's related, uh, but also um, at Nexus we're trying to not do a straight ahead skeptic conference. We want to include skepticism, but the name of it is Northeast Conference on Science and Skepticism, and we want some solid science in it. And we had some of that uh, in the last two days as well. And we've also had some incredible human stories. So we've had physics, we've had biology, really focused science, but we also had Deborah Feldman. Um, talking about her experience uh, uh, leaving the uh, Hasidic Judaism, and uh, that was a tremendous human story about religion, but also about culture and human experience. So I just think we've achieved a kind of eclecticism, something for everyone, uh, and yet everything seems to, to fit together. That's, that's the best we can hope for. And now, speaking of you founding things, you're also the co-founder of the Monday Night Magic Show, which you're going to be appearing at tomorrow night. Is that I correct? I will be headlining at Monday Night Magic tomorrow night, um, somewhere trying to get a little sleep in between. And I am one of the founders and producers of Monday Night Magic, which is now in our 15th continuous season. And we are the longest-running magic show in New York City. Actually, the, I think we're the longest-running off-Broadway show, to tell you the truth. Um, and people can find out about that at mondaynightmagic.com. It's a different show every week. And uh, we also produce a sister show called uh, Magical Nights at Feinstein's at the Feinstein's Cabaret at the Lowe's Regency Hotel on Park Avenue, and that's every Sunday night. Slightly different uh, format of a show in a beautiful upscale room. It's great food and service. It's re really lovely. And I've been to Monday Night Magic a few times, so I can vouch for the fact that you're not just bragging about something because you made it. It's a great show, so you got to check saying, that out. Thank you for saying so. So now if people want to find out what you're up to, what you're doing, it's jamieinswiss.com. Is that right? It is, but even easier to remember is also you can get there at honestliar.com. Honestliar.com. Thank you very much for joining us, Jamie. Thanks for having me.